When this spectacular gold and silver last saw the light of day, wars were raging in northern England between the Vikings and the Anglo-Saxons. In the turmoil, someone hid their wealth. Almost 700 pieces of gold and silver were crammed into a valuable cup and buried. And there they stayed for around a thousand years, until David Whelan and his son Andrew drove over from Leeds and dug them up. What these two metal detectorists found a few months ago in a North Yorkshire field is being described by experts as one of the most important finds of its type anywhere in the world. The pair were at Harrogate Coroner's Court to hear their find declared treasure trove and to explain what it felt like to dig up such an important part of British history. We were crouched down on our hands and knees and we were just sort of pulling silver bars out and yeah. there was a clump of soil that had this silver chain with a very sort of decorated bead just swinging from it and I think we were just sort of stood there shaking really, yeah. weren't we? The British Museum has spent months cleaning the hoard. Many of the 617 coins have never been seen before. There are items from Afghanistan, Ireland, Russia and Scandinavia. It was amazing. I've never seen anything quite like it. The finders did a really superb job of, um, of excavating the vessel and um, not being tempted to empty any of the, the contents from it. 